Good morning, everyone. Wednesday, February 7th, 2018. Cloudy day. Gray, gray outside. They, they say it's supposed to snow this afternoon. <clears throat> oh boy, was yesterday hectic or what? I end up having to paint on my own to do test sample. And then after that, in the afternoon, <clears throat> one of our assembler got mad for the, like the millionth time. And then he threatened a coworker. And uh, this is a big no-no at our company. So that was the last draft after 15 years and he got fired. So that puts more strain on the already strained uh, foreman over there. So my role, just step it up because I'm gonna have to help these guys as well. So, uh, why, Sam, why did you have to talk so much? Could you just tolerate the situation and do what you had to do? Well, I guess now you won't have a choice to find something else. He's all on his own. The dad couldn't do anything. And if the dad decides to leave as well, where is he gonna go? That's all they've been doing for so many years. It's not like they have a lot of qualification, unfortunately for them. They're good at doing mechanical assembly, but not every place is equal. Not every place is easy to do mechanical assembly. So when you've been doing the same thing for 15 years, I did the same thing for nine years and I was bored my mind off. So I just cannot imagine how for 15 years, my mom, my mom has been working for the same place for 30 years. She's reaching on her 31st year now. And uh, she was retired for a short while and then they, she returned there and they offer her a home job. And then they asked her to come back to work. And uh, she accepted, she was happy to go back to work. Change of face, two days a week. My mom is 69 years old. <laughs> so it's something, you know, she's very tough. I hope by that age I'll be retired and enjoying my life a little bit more. Yesterday I got an interesting call from a capital company. Financing, uh, they're offering like a financing and subventions and stuff like this. And this one seems legit. So uh, I gave the information, but I'm very surprised uh, how much is going to be the APR and interest. I'm very curious how much it's going to be. And if it passes, literally, if I just pass, I don't know what it's going to be. I told her when she started talking, she was rambling on and on, and I told her, so you are aware I'm in Canada, right? It's like, whatever you offer doesn't apply to me because I'm in another country. And she said like, no, no, it's all in house, we do offer. I said, okay, it's not gonna screw up my credit, so might as well try. So we'll see, uh, we'll see what she has to offer. I asked for 50 grand, that way I'll be able to pay all of my debt and then have some. After the 50 grand, I'll, after paying all my debt, I'll probably end up with a good sum of money so I can do some serious saving for a house. Or a new apartment, mostly new apartment. I can't, I can't complain about the job right now. I'm very happy. Like I'm responsible for my own department. I'm doing my job. And, I'm helping to every other thing, so it's never a boring moment, which was, which was basically what I really wanted. I wanted something that wasn't the routine, that wasn't going to be the same thing every day, and I was going to get bored and tired and sad and depressed, so what more can I ask for? I had a, a company call, uh, not call, but I mean they wrote me yesterday a headhunter agency. They were looking for a technical advisor and a assistant supervisor. And, uh, I'm curious what it is. 
So uh, I'll wait for her reply today. Because I'm, I'm always looking for more. And right now, uh, this one I've seen, uh, <clears throat> I've seen one uh, yesterday, well, for the rest of the week, the owner of the company is there. And then I saw how the director is nervous around him trying to cover everything and try to make everything run smoothly showing that after how many years he can handle things but barely so I don't know I'm there to do a job and I'm just trying to do that job the last painter that was there the not this the new one that got I had to live to quit, but the last one that I had an argument with, he uh, he kind of ruined things at work for me, spreading words around and bullshits. He didn't know that I was bullshitting him, and then he turns around and he bullshit me as well. So he kind of screw up a lot of relation that I was trying to develop with others. So my position, uh, my status and position towards these guys went down by 50%. So until I can deliver what I promise, it won't be much. So that's pretty much it for now. That's all the action that went in my life yesterday. So I'll keep you guys posted. Have a good day everyone.